know, started at Bar Camp Philly. It started out in 2009, and it was started by Dr. Kristen Swanson and 10 of her cohorts. If you Google this, you can easily find the history for them. Or if you go to their website, www.edcamp.org, you can find everything there is to know about how EdCamp was started and organized. EdCamp, just to summarize it, is basically a group of people like us right here that decide to take charge of their own professional development. Instead of waiting for your school superintendent or you know professional department or me to come to your school and talk to you guys, you get together in this table and you say, hey, let's take charge of our professional development. That's the first step. The second step is you say, what do we want to talk about? So in EdCap style, what you do is you either take a whole bunch of butcher paper like we did yesterday in your own conference, put it on top of the table, you have people write one question per piece of paper or a sticky note, and then at the end of gathering the questions, people vote on each one of the questions that got written down on these pieces of paper. Once that done, based on the stickies that got the most votes <coughs> for those questions, the topics of the sessions that are actually going to be presented get selected. Cool concept, then. Eh? If you add to that social media, then that has a whole separate component for it because you can have multiple sessions going in at one time and then as the group split, you use the feet, the rule of the two feet. If you're in a session, let's say, uh, what's your name, sir? Brian is in a session about social media, but he wants to learn about coding and he's not that interested in that session. He gets up and he goes to the next session. And now he's taking charge of his learning because time is valuable because that's what real professional development is. Like Todd said this morning when we were in the room over there, you know what I mean? You got to take charge of your own learning. And then the flip side of that is let the kids take charge of their own learning. You can have a camp with your kids. Let them select what their topic is going to be, what they want to talk about, what interests them. Obviously, you're still going to provide the guidance that is needed to guide them to where you want them to go so they can get to where you want them to be.